Christmas. Happy New Year to everyone. We know as the year ends, we have our friends, food and fellowship. How about our fight game? That also is an important aspect to us, the viewers, and the people who participate in supporting these fighters as they bring us the enjoyment, the entertainment of the fight game itself. We do have a present for you. On behalf of NorthTexasBoxing.com again, we're here, Roland Gomez with Roland's Corner, to deliver you a present, and that is, we have categories. I want to give you a synopsis. You can read the actual details of what each classification that we're going to give you as far as our fighter of the year, our round of the year, our top 10. We're going to have all that information on our site, but let's go through this right quick and see what you think of this. Our top 10 fighters of the year. Starting at number 10, out of Wichita Falls, James Freeman, rugged fighter. Keep your eyes on him, James Freeman. Number nine, Ty Cobb, also out of Wichita Falls. These young men are making some noise up in Wichita Falls area. Keep your eyes on these people as tomorrow's champions are being presented today. Number eight, Chap Higgins. Huggins, he is the chapstick with that straight, straight jab. I had to steal that from you, Sean Reed. The chapstick. Chap Huggins, rank number eight on our list, pound for pound. Number seven, Teron Terezi, Washington, out of Oak Cliff, South Oak Cliff to be exact. Dallas, Texas, Teron rounds out our number seven slot. Number six, Kendrick Welliford from Fort Worth. Kendrick, keep the hands up. Keep, keep the motor in drive. Dallas's Jesse Lada, number five. Number four, Fort Worth's Luis Hernandez. And number three, Dallas's Hector Beltran. Number two, it was a close, it was a close vote within the North Texas boxing staff. Coming up with your number one and number two. Number two, Charles Hadley, the massive machine of destruction, better known as the future, comes in at number two. And Roberto Marroquin, number one, pound for pound, North Texas boxings, number one. Again, pound for pound, five. We do have a couple of other, other categories that we actually put a lot of time and effort in trying to find who is our certain type. Number one, let me just kind of just go to this right here. Our comeback fighter of the year was Arthur Trevino. Arthur Trevino, we thank you. Almost a three-year layoff, but you came back and you delivered a 3-0 and record with one knockout. Uh, our rookie of the year, Luis Yanis. He's our Texas State Super Flyweight Champion. So our uh, newcomer of the year is Luis Yanis. And now for the coveted fighter of the year, Roberto Marroquin. Roberto, we thank you so much for what you've done and what you are as far as even outside that ring, a scholar and a gentleman. But getting back to what you bring to the ring, we thank you. Our fighter of the year, the coveted title for NorthTexasBoxing.com, Roberto Marroquin. On behalf of our staff here, I thank everyone who took part on the North Texas Boxing dot com's staff voting, taking their time to put this primer together. I salute you. I thank you. On behalf, again, www.NorthTexasBoxing.com, your sports commentator and love for the sport, Roland Gomez. See you at the next session of Rolling School.